everyone, it's Cece. Welcome to my channel. If you've been here before, we're on EU today. If you haven't been here, take a look around and hit that subscribe button. So for today, I'm gonna be upping some runes. So I've done like rune crafting videos, but I haven't really done like rune upgrading videos, which I mean, I don't know if it's gonna be as boring as it might be, but. <laughs> so some time ago, I did do some crafting of runes. And at the time of that video, I was like, I had really bad luck rolling runes, so I, I didn't do it in that video. But I was like, you know what, today, talk to you guys a little bit, upgrade some runes, tell you what I'm looking for um, in a rune when I keep it, when I sell it, things like that. So this one is one that I actually crafted, which, I mean, pretty good rune, potentially. It could also potentially be a really horrible rune. So we're gonna go straight to plus 12 and hope it goes into speed. <laughs> Is that too much to hope for? And you can also cry with me when it goes into things that I don't want it to go into, like so far resistant. Not the worst though, it is an HP rune, so it's obviously gonna be on a support unit. Um, but could be worse. Okay, there we go, we got one into speed. And then I'd probably swap out um, something for defense percent, most likely. So like in a support rune, um, depending on like who you're gonna put it on, hopefully you have an idea in your head when you're upping runes. If not, then you kind of just focus on the rune and the stats in it to see how efficient it is. So for me looking at an HP rune, I know I'm gonna put this one on a support unit um, versus like a bruiser. Um, so I'm gonna be looking for, for sure for speed. And I actually don't mind the resistance. If I put it on somebody that's a little bit tanky, that's not so bad. It's failing a lot for going to plus nine. <laughs> Just saying. Any day, there you go. Oh, speed again, okay. Um, I'm happy about that already. <laughs> this could have rolled quite poorly, but we're, we've gotten pretty lucky with this, so. This is gonna be a rune I'm definitely gonna have to, we'll grind in that speed some more. And then, I wonder where the last one's gonna go. Probably swap something out here, potentially. Hmm. Could also be a decent, like, bruiser rune, I guess, but... The person I'm thinking of right now that I'd put this on is probably a Ladril. That's what I'm thinking. So I'm to be quick, for sure, on Violent. He's gonna need that HP. The resistance will be nice as well. So he'll be going on HP Will. The plan. If it ever goes to plus 12. I probably won't plus 15 it because then we'll be sitting here for a while, but I'll use power up stones. I do have a lot of those guys, so. It's exhausting. All I need you to do is go to plus 12. That's it. Not asking too much. It only went to speed twice, which could have been a lot worse. That's fine, but a third time would have been. I need to see what else I need to potentially upgrade. Some of these ones, too, that, um, Some of the ones that were crafted actually had like really bad substats. <laughs> like the main stat would be like good and then the substats would be just garbage. Hence some of these runes being like really ugly looking runes. <laughs> That's a low roll. I swear it's not just me though, but I find like anytime they have the power up event, like where they have stones in like included, my runes seem to fail more. <laughs> like a tinfoil hat theory, right? Like put on your tinfoil hat. <laughs> totally not what's happening, it just feels that way. But I also normally don't watch my runes when I upgrade them. So um, depending on like what rune it is, if it's a blue rune, I'll put it to six. If it's um, a hero rune like this, I'll put it to nine and then legendaries I'll put to 12. And I don't normally pay attention to them. I will click upgrade and I'll do something else. Like now, it's kind of nice because we can go into chat. 
versus like sitting around watching your runes upgrade. So it's a good quality of life update that they did. So you don't have to sit there watching your runes. You can actually go into chat and do other things. Because honestly, watching runes power up is so painful, especially when it goes to bad stats. At least if you put a rune to like, whatever, nine or 12. Okay, that's not bad. Um, you can put it to like nine or 12 and then you don't pay attention to it. But if you watch it and you watch it roll into all the bad stats, somehow it, it gets worse. It hurts. So like with my runes, I guess I could have done it this way. I still have a few that I should put up to six with this event going on, at least. At least to six I should be doing. Um, but for a lot of these ones, I'll probably put them just straight to nine or 12, depending. Uh, I should feel like I shouldn't watch it. That's already a bad one. <laughs> like that already went into like the one stat that I, I didn't want it to go into. And it had good potential starting out with speed being six. Oh, do we see this? Oh. A bad room. I'm gonna see where the nine goes. If it goes into there, we're done. Please no. Just jinxed it. Oh my god, do you see that? Look at this rune! Oh my gosh! Oh! No! That's not... It had so much potential and I... <laughs> I'm sad now. You can peek into my EU runes as I'm clicking on them and how bad some of them are. Goodness. I don't want to worry about five star ones right now. What else? I knew I crafted this one. This was a good one too. Yeah, this is from crafting. There's no N8 on it though, so I probably wouldn't react this. Um, hopefully, and I'm not gonna say it, because as soon as I say it, it's gonna jinx it, but you know what I'm thinking, right? Where we don't want it to go? Okay. Good. That one rune though, what a horror story. Please comment down below, what was your worst like rune upgrade? Cause that's pretty bad. It was a legend too. Gosh, what could have been? Same thing with this. This one, would I would have like, it's kind of an all around rune, right? <laughs> Between HP, defense, attack. The flat defense is something I planned to swap out, and I still will probably. I think I'm gonna keep that on there, but it's too bad it did roll one into there. That's one I would have liked to swap out, but. Okay, we'll throw some grinds on this room later and then we're good. Or waste all the mana. I know I have power up stones, but I usually use those when I'm going from 12 to 15 on a rune. I won't use them before that. It also usually, I feel like, doesn't fail this much going to 12. So. <laughs> Actually, somebody, one of you mentioned in one of the videos I did with runes, we were talking about this, and how they should improve your chat. Like, the more your rune fails and your chances of getting a successful upgrade should increase. It's not a bad idea, like, because this has failed quite a bit. It's just eating mana at this point. And I think one of my worst runes probably used, it was a few million. I don't even know how many million. See, oh, like flat defense twice. Why did you have to do that to you? It's so much potential. Not that it's like a bad rune now or anything, but I mean, come on. So this one being a hero, I'm just gonna put it to nine and then 12 like later but it is honestly the best time to at least like go through your runes i was like i'm at 662 on this account of 700 and i plan to go through every single rune put it to six at least for free and then go through and then sell and clean out what i don't need it's the best time honestly to clean out your runes 
So this one, this would be also a good support in between HP and defense, which it's already gone to. So if it stays away from attack, um, that would be ideal. Unless I didn't go into attack now because I said it, which could potentially happen. But some of you like asked um, to do some type of a rune guide video. And it's it's a complicated thing when you're first, I'm happy with how that powered up as well. When you're first starting the game and like what runes to keep, what to focus on, like how you know if a rune is good or not. And the further you get into the game, I would say the more like picky usually you become with runes. Oh, this is one I crafted too that had the innate speed, like awful. That speed should not be up there. It should be something else there, but that's okay. Do I have anything else? I had that one. No speed on it. I kept a lot of um, random ones I crafted as well. Saying I would up them later and then see how things went. So this one could potentially be a really good one as well, depending on where it upgrades, right? <laughs> So as I was saying, like early on in game, there's gonna be, like you're not gonna be as picky with runes as you are later on. Like people will also try so, so hard to get the bonus from completing a set. Like if you're doing despair, like you want four like despair runes and later on you'll notice a lot more broken sets going on and that's okay too if you're focusing just on stats. So, I mean, in the beginning, you're probably not gonna be as worried about substats and what's on the rune, but People are usually pretty helpful in game and like if you ask or if you're in a guild, ask your guildies. Um, you can also check out like what friends are using on rune stuff. But don't be afraid to experiment with your own builds. I do that all the time. Doesn't always work well, but <laughs> usually with monsters, there's like set runes that work for them. They're tried and tested and true. So far this one's not doing too bad. It has gone into speed. I'm surprised we avoided the resistance as well because usually that's where they go. Is I should have also checked how much mana I started with to how much I'm with now. Even though we're not going to 50, that would be a whole other few million. Like I'd probably use all my mana essentially on just those few rooms. If we actually went to 15 on all of them. One more level. Okay, there you go. Hey, we got speed again! So it did go to defense once, but it did go to speed the other time. So the only thing with this rune is I don't like the innate HP percent. Um, so we'll figure out somebody to use it on, but we're happy with that speed at least. I could sit here all day just at the rooms. I probably won't though. But there's a lot to go through. See, the, like these ones are also ones that are crafted that like look, look at these substats so bad, right? Like this is probably what I'm gonna have to sell unless it, even then, I don't know, it's a bad rune. <laughs> but like I said, since I'm on my EU account, I'll probably up it at least to six, see how it goes, go from there. Yeah, so it's just a few little rune upgrades. Yeah, okay. So that's it for today's video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up, take a look around the channel, consider subscribing, and bye for now. Next level.